subscribe. Hey, 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 Gramps, how you doing? Mm -hmm. A little late, but we got an interesting day ahead. Don't try to sweet talk me, kiddo. Okay, just a few, few words of greeting. But, uh, and, hey, Mr. Pugh, how are you? I'm not an uncomplicated man, Greg, I know that. Nevertheless, I have tried, as much as I am able, to show you love and compassion. Yeah, oh yeah, are you kidding? You're, you're the best darn grandpa out. Um, and I wanted, therefore, to ask you. You asked me for help, and I took that request seriously. And now I hear that you've dispensed with Roger's services, presumably to throw your lot in with my brother and his gang of crapulous shills, without even so much as a telephone call. Right. I was actually wondering if I shouldn't maybe take another turn around the block with old Mr. Pugh here. I have cause... known Roger Pugh for 55 years. You don't take him for a fucking ride anywhere. He's a friend of mine. I, I mean, I, I, I... Okay, I, I guess the other route is to see if there's any way that you might see your way clear to providing a little financial support to help me retain my neutrality amongst... Roger. I'm helping your grandfather transfer the entirety of his estate to charitable endeavors. What's, what, what? I'm giving all my money to Greenpeace, Greg. Um, what, even my part? That was the first part. Why, what? Why is that the first part? I mean, how, how do you, how can you tell? I mean, because, why? because, Greg, your life is not a bagatelle. Because you are putting yourself in the service of a monstrous endeavor. Because... Because you need to take yourself seriously, kid. Now we should go in.